Okay, the next section of the video, what we're going to cover is the guard. I'm going to be in the guard and we're going to give you two basic, easy ways to escape the guard. We're not going to do any techniques, it's just basically escaping, how to escape from that position. Okay? We'll probably do this in more than one angle so that you get a good wide view. This being Mike in the guard. Josh is in the guard right now. Okay? Uh, now basically we're just going to move around a little bit and try to work these things in separately uh, a little bit so you can see how they would work. Okay, so let's go ahead. Okay, the first one, you want to get these legs down, scoop the feet and pull him out. Grabbing the head and the arm and rolling over on top. Then you have the top straddle position and the honeymoon position at the same time. Several different things that you can do from here between punching Head button, elbowing, and arm locks. Okay? Now he's going to want to try to keep his hands up here to keep me from doing this. That would allow me to put arm locks on him. Anything that I want to do. But that's not the point of it. We're just escaping the guard right now. That is one. We'll do it again. So as we wrap around, you want to get your feet in low behind, scoop, and out. You want to grab this arm. Pull it in and roll him over. Okay? And you, you'll be on top. Okay? Let's spin around this way. Right here. Okay? Going to get the feet in, pull him out. You're taking his base out from under him. You can roll either way, but you want to try to roll the way you have the arm. Okay? You have this arm controlled, that's the way you want to roll. Okay? If I'm like this, I would want to roll this way. But that's basically what you're doing. You're hooking, pulling it out. Okay? That's number one. Number two. This, I call this the hip kick technique. Basically, we're down here. Come on, we're around a little bit. I want to get this foot out. This one here, or this one, will go this way. You kick this hip out and roll over. You took that base out and you just roll right into that position and we're in our top straddle position. Okay, what we're doing, get that foot up there, kick it out and turn. Okay, get in the top straddle position. But you gotta have him nice and tight to you when you do this. If he's up here at a high base and you do this, he might catch himself and it'd be harder to do. So you got to get him when he's down close to you. Kick that hip out and turn. And you get in a tough straddle position. Last time. I go this way. In the top straddle position. One more. Okay. Rest around some. Okay. 